Like many young girls, I used to play with makeup, but I never got to the point where I'm actually good at makeup. I don't really know why I like makeup. I like how it looks. I mean, I color, I cut my hair, I paint my nails. Why don't I wear makeup? It might have something to do with the fact that I had a not like other girls phase when I was 12. But I've just always, like, felt weird about, like, wanting to wear makeup or, like, ugh. like, what if I'm really bad and, like, someone sees me like this? Yeah, that's basically it. I'm home alone right now, and I'm gonna be home alone for, like, basically a whole month. So I decided... Now might be a good time to, like, try to get good at, or at least, like, experiment a little bit. Because I, like, never wear makeup, I don't really have makeup. Um, I'm just gonna show you what I'm working with. Um, there's two eyeshadow- oh. When I say makeup, I mean just the eyes. I'm not gonna do, like, the whole, like, I'm sorry, I'm too lazy, but, um, yeah, and I don't know why it's in a bag right now, but there's some brushes. This is a mascara, and we have an eyeliner. So, for today, I'm, I'm just gonna do my eyeliner as, like, a little beginner thing. You can probably tell I have, like, pretty extreme hooded eyes. That actually makes it more difficult for me. So I, I know that there's like tutorials and stuff on how to do eyeshadow for hooded eyes. I'm just gonna wing it. <laughs> Get it? Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna do my eyeliner. I have a, <laughs> I have a mirror. Um, and I also have this big mirror here. This is the eyeliner I'm working with. Maybe this would be easier with like a pencil eyeliner, but I don't have one. Uh, I'm sure my mom has one, but I don't know where her makeup stuff is. I also have this mascara. And if I'm feeling crazy, I might do some eyeshadow, but I, I think I'm just gonna do the eyeliner. I don't even know how to start. Um, I opened my because I had my eyes closed while I was doing the line and <laughs> because I don't know I guess this takes a while to dry I don't think I can work with that maybe someone who is like actually talented could work with that but it looks good with my eyes closed I mean like the what I'm working with like, ignore that but then when I open, it looks weird. I look like I'm I'm trying to do like an Egyptian thing. So clear denial. Wow, this is starting to look so good. Is that like Okay, it's it's not really a winged eyeliner, but doesn't it look kind of good? Like Right? Will I be able to do it on the other eye? <laughs> I used this I don't actually know what, what you're supposed to use this brush for. I'm pretty sure it's for your eyes, but I- oh, oof. it's a bit like blotchy, but <laughs> um, you see what I'm going for? Because I have like downturned eyes, and so if I m like make it look more <laughs> downturned, that's like, I don't know, it's kind of interesting, right? Yet. Okay, so that's the finished look for day one. It's um... It does look like the makeup that, like, a preteen would do. I can tell it's uneven, but I don't know how to fix it. Oh, I think it looks pretty good with the glasses. <laughs> because, because I never do my makeup, I think, oh, this looks pretty good, but I'm, I'm scared of sounding like that, that one Shane Dawson meme. So I'm up, I actually got a, oh. I actually got a lot of um, a lot of the eyeliner on my eyelashes, and so there's just like clumps of eyelashes just together.
I just left my makeup from yesterday on like the whole day and then when I showered it didn't fully come off um also I'm not gonna wear mascara again because I don't I don't like the way it makes my eyelashes feel my I look like I haven't <laughs> slept I think it, it could work to our advantage you know so yesterday the the eyeliner that I did actually took me like a really long time I, I wasn't checking the time but I might be able to check the time on the the videos and I, I'll be able to see then how long it took um, so I'm just gonna do a very basic uh, black eyeshadow other than the like really thick eyelashes I'm kind of going for something like this Queen Barb I love her so much so the picture here let's uh yeah I only have two um, eyeshadow palette as I showed yesterday this one we got it from TK Maxx and then we have this one it was on sale it's from sports girl I don't know why they're so dirty but we want black and actually maybe maybe I should add some colors because I don't have a uh, black eyeshadow I'm just gonna use the, the same eyeliner from yesterday and I have these brushes I don't know which one will be the best. Maybe this one. And I'm just gonna like blend it out. That did not turn out how I wanted to. Um, maybe I should have washed the brushes before I used them. Um, because well, I guess I did want to use pink, so the pink is fine. But this one had like orange on it. There, it's like very blotchy. Um, I don't. <laughs> I mean, I did use an eyeliner, so what I did, I was just like boop boop boop, and then I like smudged some but it probably wasn't the best way to do it wow that looks really bad um okay i'm gonna wipe that off and try again i i don't know how to how to blend it i don't know how to do it how about i try exactly what i'm doing right now but with eyeshadow it won't be black but it'll be a different color we have this uh makeup remover but I still, I still have some like under my eyes. I don't know how visible it is, but it's it's definitely noticeable in real life. I'm gonna use this pink. Um, yeah, that that's pretty good, right? I mean, it literally took me like ten seconds to do, but honestly, that's kind of what I'm going for. I'm going for like easy, simple, but not too subtle you know it's like it's a pretty uh, bright pink today i'm wearing this yellow shirt and i was inspired um by myself so this is one of my characters and she wears like pink eyeliner i don't have pink eyeliner i'm just gonna try to recreate it okay this is what i'm starting with um it's really not that pigmented. Um, I don't know if that's because I'm not applying it properly or because this is just not very good eyeshadow. Okay, so I added some pink, but I'm noticing that like right, I don't know how visible it is, right under my eye over here, the color is like not sticking. But I'm also like getting some of the eyeshadow on my eyelashes i don't know how to fix that maybe i'm supposed to fix it with mascara but i'm not gonna wear mascara because i don't like it now with this like really tiny brush i think i'm gonna wet it and then see if that makes it more pigmented to do the like fake eyeliner um i tried my hardest and that's what matters right I used a reference photo, but I, I couldn't really copy it. Maybe I should just make my videos with this filter because it, it really makes the colors stand out more. So today I'm wearing my uh, Bratz shirt. And I was thinking, oh, maybe I can do a look based on a Bratz doll. But I don't know, like, I can't think of any right now. I'm not like... A massive Bratz fan. So instead, I'm gonna do a look inspired 
by another MGA doll brand. Totally out of my comfort zone, but I thought maybe I could try something similar at least to what Punk Girl has. Okay, so those like clown lines are actually very difficult to do, who would have known? I erased them before I could show them because they were that bad. Um, okay, I think this one actually looks pretty good. Um, I don't know what's happening with this side. I just, they're kind of uneven. Um, it's so messy and I have an eyelash in my eye. It was just too ambitious. Um, I should have known from the beginning that I wouldn't be able to do it. So today what I'm gonna do is just go extra hard. I didn't say this earlier, but actually a big, like, motivator for me, wanting to get better at, I mean, eyeshadow, specifically eyeshadow, is that I'm really into um, the scene aesthetic. I, it's not my goal to become seen because, like, I don't have the personality for it. So with me, I have this. I've never tried this flavor. I just saw it in Kohl's and I was like, orange monster! Because I've never had an orange one. Well, actually, this is kind of peach. So I'm going to try this right now. It has not been in the fridge, but that's fine. Um, I like, I like drinking um, carbonated drinks. When they haven't been in the fridge, I still think they taste good. Sometimes I think they even taste better. It smells really good. Oh, I really like those like um, peach ring candies. I hope it, it probably will taste something like that. It smells really good though. And I love, I love the can. I'm one of those people that like collects the cans as decoration. It tastes exactly like this, like peach candies, oh my god. I wash them by the way, okay? They're not collecting mold. I only keep one of each can, okay? It's fine, I wash them with water and soap, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look up a tutorial and I'm just gonna go for it, okay? I did kind of just go for it last time and it didn't turn out very good. But also looking back, it wasn't too bad. It could have been a lot worse, to be honest. Like, I literally just searched up scene makeup tutorial, and there was a whole playlist with a hundred videos, so I just went on that one. But I also found this. I found it in my mom's room. I mean, I thought I was just digging through her stuff. Okay, so uh, this is not a substitute for a pencil eyeliner. I mean, just by looking at the shape, I should have known. Uh, I need to practice with what I have so that in the future when I'm like, all right, I can actually buy the proper tools to do it better. I swear I applied it the same way on both eyes, but it turned out so different. Um, also, I'm just gonna give up on using a tutorial. Okay, I need to learn how to do it my own way. I did say that I was gonna try extra hard today, so I'm not finishing here. I need to add more. So I was thinking of doing like, kind of like a wing going here like that, but I actually think it's gonna look really bad and not due to lack of skills, due to my hooded eyes, you know? Okay, this is the shape I'm starting with. Um. Yeah, I'll, I'll try to fix it. Okay, it doesn't help that my face is just uneven. Like, like I've been told this by a doctor. I have an uneven face. I found a new tutorial and it was called goth makeup look. So I'm not really sure if I'm still following the scene thing, but uh, they're both like in the same family, you know? I'm, like surprising myself at how straight the lines are, but it's like, visibly uneven. <laughs> this does not suit me. I definitely need to get a pencil eyeliner because this is taking too long to dry. I feel like I just glued my eyes together. Um, also, this eyeliner like kind of starts to crack um, after it's been on for a while. I mean, not even for a while. This has been on my eyes for like less than an hour, let's say less than an hour. 
like when I have my eyes like that, that looks kind of interesting. But the point of it is that it's supposed to look good um, when your eyes are like this and when your eyes are like all the way open. I'm going to put as much as of this under my eyes as I can. It like, <laughs> I just, I extended it too much. I think someone could pull this off. It's just not me, okay? I'm going to add some color over here. I feel like it, it might end up looking interesting. Okay, I think now's a good time to stop. Uh, my eyes are getting watery, like they're actually stinging. Maybe the makeup is just expired. <laughs> also, I put on uh, mascara. I know I said I wouldn't, but it's, it's a special occasion. It's Monday. Let's go crazy and let's put um, some eyeliner on my lips. How did it get all over my teeth? I look a bit mischievous. I'm not adding that. <laughs> I don't know how every time I do something, I end up like really straying from what I originally had planned. Like, I, I, w I thought I was really going to commit to this scene thing, but this to me looks more goth goth on their first day of being goth, I guess. Real eyes, real eyes, real lies. Uh, yesterday's look has left me feeling really tired, um, so I'm gonna do something really simple today. I'm just gonna do like a blue eyeshadow. Trying to do eyeliner under the eyes with the liquid eyeliner is like impossible, um, I always mess up doing the eyeliner, so then I thought, I'll just add more eyeliner to cover up the mistake. And then I make more mistakes, and now I, I don't know how to fix it. Um, I didn't I didn't finish doing this eye, well I mean I kind of gave up on this one, so I don't even really have the chance to finish this one. Um, so yeah, it's not asymmetrical because I'm really bad, it's asymmetrical because I give up. Um, for today. I I'm still gonna try tomorrow, um, but I think what I need to do is go back to doing the really simple looks. I feel like I'm just, I'm being too ambitious right now, so I'm gonna do like, um, I think this was like trending for a bit, but where people put like, like a rainbow over here and then like, like sometimes they put like a dark color on top. I might just do the, the rainbow underneath, but, um... I know you're supposed to add primer to make, like, the color stick on better, but I don't have primer, and I honestly can't be bothered, okay? Okay, so I tried to, like, kind of blend it. Oh, it's not really blended here, but I don't know if it actually really made a difference, um... Wait, doesn't that look kind of sick though? Like, it's really subtle, but it's like, it's there. 